Hey superstars, welcome back to another one of my autograph videos where I doodle a sports ball player and bug them through the mail for an autograph. I came here to do two things, make videos and chew bubble gum. And I'm not chewing this particular piece of gum. This was my pack of 86 tops from last year's junk wax challenge. I got a few of these back. So let's bug Tom Gorman today. Not to be confused with Gorman Thomas, according to the Wikipedia, Tom Gorman was a left-handed relief pitcher, and that's about it. He wasn't even on the 86 Mets. He was in Philly in 86, so that means we get to make stuff up. Let's see, Gorman, Gorman, Gorman. Trust the Gormans, fishermen. No, uh, some sort of Tom, Dick, and Harry thing. My dad's name is Dick. I had an Uncle Harry, and I have two Uncle Toms and a cousin Tom, but uh, none of them played baseball, so that one's not going anywhere. Um, Tom Gorman. 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 There's that old pinball game, Gorgar. Huh. This is a toughie. Tom Gorman. Officer Gorman? That might work. Now is he a fly off the handle and turn in your badge because you're too dangerous to be a cop kind of cop? Or is he the sidekick who met his demise a week before retiring kind of cop? What happens if we mix those two together? Hmm. Um, so after his seven year baseball career with the Expos, Mets, Phillies, and Padres, he was brought into the force as a left-handed specialist to take down left-handed bad guys. Until one day while on his beat, he was chasing down the dad from that 70s show and forgot to call in for backup. So of course he was gunned down by a bunch of over-the-top baddies, the Mike Boddicker gang, who were mostly right-handed, so they had the upper hand. And that was when I sent this card out to get signed. So I figured it was never coming back. Fortunately, the boys down at Omni Consumer Products were able to salvage what little was left of Gorman and turn him into the ultimate left-handed crime-fighting machine, Robo Gorman. No, uh, Gorfax. I bet he tracked down the Mike Boddicker gang, got his revenge, and then he had to uncover some big maniacal corporate scheme and overcome Directive 4 to defeat the evil robot Ed Whitson 209. There's hope for this autograph just yet. All right, there's Gorfax. Here's our 86 tops, got our note, and we're off to the mailbox. Okay, you read that right. This took over a year. Let's see what we got. Nice, I'd buy that for a dollar. Signed the card beautifully. I told him he could keep the doodle, so I'm sure he hung it up in his locker down at the station. Thank you, Gorfax. I feel safer with left-handed crime-fighting robots like you roaming the streets. And thank you, citizens, for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, yada, yada, yada. And we'll see you next time.